here and as part of the volunteer program we get to participate in what we call the adaptive horse program where the volunteers get to take care of a horse over the winter and this winter my horse uh, adaptive horse was smoky and um, in January the weather got bad and um, Julie presented the idea of clicker training to teach them to paint to us and um, I liked that idea and I thought he might he might be interested in it so we tried it out um, we actually started with him just touching the end of a stick and giving him a treat for that and then eventually we asked him to touch the end of the paintbrush and then to bite down on it and hold on to it for longer and then once he could do that it was just a matter of asking him to put the paintbrush on the paper and adding a little paint for him and before we knew it he was painting pictures and so uh, we'll, we'll keep training him as we said earlier to uh, start to pick his own colors. Um, there's certain colors they can see, so we'll try and use those as opposed to ones they can't tell the difference between. So we can kind of see uh, what colors he likes to use, what colors he doesn't like to use. So, yeah. it, was, it was a very fun project to work on this winter. He has eyes on both sides of his head, so he has monocular vision. So he has a blind spot right in the middle here that he can't quite see me. So you can fix up his nose and sniff that. It's just where, where's that hand going? He trusts me enough to let me put my hand in his blind spot, and he doesn't seem to be too concerned about it. Most horses would be if they didn't hold it with that person. So he'll come over here to the painting, and he might tip his nose, or he might look to the side to try and see what he is doing. Now, we've discussed having him stand sideways and paint um, just to try and get him depth perception problem because of that. So it's, he has a hard time finding that piece of paper. But once he does, he kind of does it by feel. Typically, the sound of a carrot dropping in a bucket would make the horse stop doing what they're doing and push star. And happy for the attention. You know, it couldn't have happened to a more um, happy horse. He's quite, you know, not, not very nippy, doesn't kick, doesn't, you know.